Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Comic Game Movie Show. My name is Deshaun, and I am here to review the new and the final Star Wars The Force Awakens trailer. I just saw it watching my Philadelphia Eagles, my favorite football team. So this is a double treat for me. I get to watch my team win. I get to watch the Star Wars trailer. It all works out for me. So, anyways, I'm going to talk about it. I am... This trailer is very haunting. It's very interesting and I'm getting a little bit more about the plot I'm getting a little bit more about you know the whole place so from what I can tell because I'm not like big and great into the um, Star Wars lore I'm probably gonna we're probably gonna post another video trailer with Mark and Seth because they know a lot more about this than me but I just wanted to get my general reactions out there about how I felt about this trailer and I thought this was a great trailer I think like as far as promotion goes in my mind like as far as you know, in 2016 trailers that I've seen, it's the star, it's the Star Wars trailer, and then it's the Batman trailer. I think this trailer is actually better than the Batman vs Superman trailer. I honestly do. I like the haunting vibe of the trailer. I get the feels that like, like. So this is just me speculating. I know you can comment and be like, obviously, but I'm not super duper into Star Wars. I'm into it and I watch it, so that's why I'm reviewing it. But I'm not like in in. So. From what I can gather from the trailer, apparently the Jedi have been gone for a long time. Apparently the Jedi and the Force and all that has been gone have been gone for a long time because every because I hear people talking about the because um you have Han in there talking about how the Force is something that is um <clears throat> how the Force is something that is real that it exists and the way he's saying it is like in a yeah this really exists kind of way and then you see the black actor which I don't know what his name is but the black actor who who apparently knows how to wield this lightsaber and who's apparently and he's talking about how he's been trained to do one thing his entire life but now he can't so i'm not sure what that is um maybe he was an actual trooper of some sort and he was trained to do that his entire life and they just let him go um what, what i'm predicting is that he was a trooper of whatever the hell that was i don't think those are the clones they're not the clones he was an actual trooper and during a battle or whatnot he got lost so now he's just in the middle of nowhere and they don't give a rat's ass about him so now he's like you know doing that whole thing and you saw luke again you see luke again you see the destroyer the, um yeah the destroyer the destroyer again see um darth vader's mask again you might have heard um commentary for um layla in the end near the end so you might have heard commentator commentary from her the the oh my god this movie looks like it's gonna be gorgeous now i talk a lot about that in any review you'll see from me or you or oh from video games too is how gorgeous it looks just the graphics and the way it looks is amazing you, you you can just jump right back into this star wars world it looks fantastic i'm not 100 percent. i mean you know it didn't give away nothing but like i said if i was like a big ingrained star wars fan this this video might be like 20 minutes like honestly but i'm not like you know in i'm not like ingrained in there so from what i can get i'm excited about this movie i'm gonna go see it because i'm i'm an avid star wars watcher i'm not like a super like i said super star wars watcher but i'm an avid one so i'm gonna definitely gonna go see this movie and try to see the opening day probably not because people are buying the tickets right now i mean that was a damn good trailer for you know i enjoyed it and cool to see harrison ford comes back a han solo you saw a little glimpse of chewy I mean, you see that little robot with the, um, I, I'm not exactly sure what the hell it is. It looks like it got a bowling ball underneath it and it's just rolling. I don't know what that is, but that was pretty cool. So, all in all, like, this trailer, like, was pretty damn good. And if I, I like, if I had to give a trailer a great, I'd give this trailer a 9 because it did it exactly what it needed to. We went BAM! And I'm like, okay, I'm ready. I am ready for this movie. I am. I am hyped for Star Wars The Force Awakens can't wait to see it and figure out what the hell's going on because like I said I'm not uh, even one watching it I'm like I'm not 100% sure how to piece this together but Star Wars Force Awakens trailer great trailer looking forward to the movie we'll probably have a second review out with people who actually know a little bit more about it so look forward to that one thank you